Welcome back. The mayor of Sacramento is calling today historic as the county and city announce a legally binding partnership to help the homeless. They're calling it the Homeless Services Partnership Agreement. Roxanne Elias explains some of the key services and commitments in this historic agreement. Everyone wants to cooperate so badly and everyone wants to reach a certain goal. Uh, which is the, you know, ending homelessness in Sacramento. Joseph Smith says it's no secret the city of Sacramento and the county have had some trouble in the past working together to end homelessness. But today that's come to an end as both parties agree to meet the needs of the unhoused and homeless. This is a health and human services approach, but it does not preclude using tools that might require somebody to accept the help if they're unwilling to. A point in time homeless count estimates there are more than 9,000 people experiencing homelessness throughout the county. The agreement will identify the roles and responsibilities of the city and the county. It will also operate multidisciplinary teams compromised of 10 behavioral health workers, which will be county funded. As for the price tag on the efforts, Eric Guerra with the city of Sacramento says there isn't one just yet. The most important part about the legally binding partnership agreement is it focused on what are the tools to make sure that we're capturing all of the federal drawdown dollars. Mayor Daryl Steinberg says you may not not notice a difference right away, but you will be able to see active engagement as soon as next week. What we have been missing and what we now will have is the commitment to actually be out in these encampments for as long as it is reasonably necessary. So what next? The city and county representatives tell us they'll work to identify and prioritize mm. encampment sites and deploy teams to 20 encampments per month. We're told there will be two teams deployed starting next week.